Hello, my name is Jesus, and today I'm going to give you a demonstration how to convert or transform regular plastic bags into a final product or a wheel. Uh, this example, I already did uh, three examples. Uh, I, convert, I did this wheel, a uh, uh, square plastic high density polyethylene, and another wheel. So I'm going to show you right now how I did it. Uh, you're going to need olive oil, bags, and a metal can. First thing you're going to do is set it up your kitchen at low temperature and add the olive oil inside of your sauce pan. I'm going to add just a little bit because I already add some previously because I want the, the olive oil to start warming inside. After a couple of seconds, you're going to start adding the bags. I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. This polymer or this bag is high density polyethylene, which is a thermoplastic. So when I get the or I put this bag inside of the sauce pad, it's going to start melt, melting immediately. So I'm going to show you right now, I'm adding the bag. And as you can see, it starts melting immediately when it gets in contact with the oil. What is happening right now is that the temperature inside of the oil of the pot is high enough to deform the material, to melt the material. Now I'm going to start moving the wax inside. I estimate that we're gonna need um, seven or eight bag, bags, something around that. Um, I have more bags over here. I'm gonna add another one right now. As you can see it started forming again pretty quickly. If you want to check the material of your bag, uh, for example, this one is high density polyethylene, but other bags in other uh, stores they, they can be low density polyethylene or an other material. You can also melt the low density polyethylene uh, in this oil or, or for this experiment I'm not gonna do it because I'm just gonna do uh, or use uh, high density polyethylene or if you want or you can you can use it as well. Gonna add some more. Remember that I'm trying to melt as many as but I mean I mean as many bags as I can so it can fit in this area. So right now I have some of them. I'm gonna start adding the bags. In the pot and check. Looks good. I'm gonna add some more. this two bags and now 
now I'm gonna apply some pressure to the wax so they can mix together. Right. It's pretty hot right now, so be careful. So you can see. Try to apply a little bit of pressure so you you get in the shape to the shape you want and you mix them together. After this, what you're gonna do is put it in the fridge for a couple of minutes. Let's say like you can put a your polymer inside of your fridge for 10 to 15 minutes and the end result will be this wheel. It's pretty rigid, it's pretty solid, it's really a strong so you can see see the demonstration gets really really strong. So that's how you create high density polyethylene wheel. You can uh, do pretty much uh, whatever you want, pretty much what you want, and uh, you can create a toy if you want. I mean, the shape is really weird, gets really weird because I don't have like a real mold to um, you know to pour the uh, the high density polyethylene I just get from the pot. But um, it proved me that it's really, really, really strong when it melts, so you can recycle these bags if you would like to do it. Uh, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you.